Hello and welcome to Talk Audio TV and a rather even smugger than normal Adam Rayner. I know you're wondering how that's physically possible but uh, the reason I'm so thrilled is uh, because of where I am. Um, if you look up on the wall up there that says uh, Road Angel. Now Road Angel uh, manufacture the, uh, in my opinion, some of the finest safety alert systems. Certainly got the best speed camera alert uh, database but that's not really the issue. The issue is this geezer stood uh, next to the car, well both of them. This is uh, Mr. Mark Tickroom. Hello, Mark. Hello. Um, uh, this man is the governor, Road Angel. But this, this is Steve Bagsy Biagioni, who, as the uh, governor of the race company, Jack Speed, told me, is definitely the best looking of the drivers, you lucky boy. <laughs> Poor fella. Now, the thing is, I know you're looking happy now, but just think back to that moment at Santa Pop and you discovered somebody had jacked your car, dude. How did you feel when that car? was missing Steve it was an experience in itself um, did you cry yeah I did actually yeah, for man. quite some time um, dude it hurt and <laughs> words can't describe the emotion that, uh, and the you know sheer shock that happened on rage that fury you were imagining how you're gonna hurt these people in graphic technicolor can't repeat on video on YouTube type stuff it was just more of an amazement you know um, the sheer brass to, neck to see the empty space of where the car was meant to be was uh, it just, hurt man yeah emotional and then how emotional was it when the internet exploded? I, I looked up, I just, I stole in Jack's feet, 64,000 references, something like 12 hours later, dude. This car was being videoed up the motorway everywhere, wasn't it? I was actually on the road at the time looking for the car and uh, yeah. receiving information from all different sources, so I didn't really understand at the time um, how, how amazing the internet was playing a part yes. in trying to find this car. It really did it. Yeah, it wasn't really till the Sunday afternoon that yes. someone rang me straight away and told me so that. The, it's been found. Now, of course, I got in here quite late after I was going to sort of put something on my Talk Audio KUK site where we talk about mobile electronics. And then uh, I thought, well, hang on, the guys at Road Angel, who I've known for a good some time, they can sort this out. And uh, this man, Mark, here is the man who did the Del Monte job and basically changed the issue. The horse might have gone back in the uh, somewhat bolted stable, but you've got a big, ugly bolt which you've uh, got for this man, have you not, Mr. Thickroom? You certainly have. And. Uh, there's more than one kind of tracking that your company does because I know that you do uh, ones for motorcycles as well as assets whether they're racing cars or caravans or of course the ones for uh, posh motors and so forth. Yeah, you've got a vehicle, we'll try and track it whatever uh, variation you've got. And I gather also that the, uh, the full James Bond is the, uh, the, the litter trail that this thing, every 60 seconds this thing updates so uh, if you're fretful about where your car is Steve in the future, Bagsy, you're going to know. <laughs> And you can look it up on your phone, you probably will, you'll be like some nervous mum going, where's my baby? But um, guys, thank you so, so very much. Adam Rayner, particularly chuffed to be the one who waved the magic wand, because I have to be uh, honest and let you know, your receptionist worked this one out as well. She sat there in front of the internet going, should have had one of our trackers. Of course the girl was right. Adam Rayner, signing off for Talk Audio TV. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you.